Hey everyone, I am Damian Holbrook from TV Guide Magazine and TV Insider, and I am talking with Annabeth Gish from Lifetime's Gone Mom uh, on June 5th. And this is uh, a true story that is terrifying. This morning, mother of five, Jennifer Dulos, was reported missing. You need to find her husband. Uh, Annabeth, tell me about this case, because this is a real case with actual real evidence that you were able to use. It's, it's, a, it's a terrifying and tragic story, to be true. Um, it's the story of Jennifer Farber Dulos, who was a mother of five and uh, was, has went missing, the disappearance of her, um, after her divorce from Fotis Dulos. And subsequent evidence over time, she disappeared May 14th of 2018, I think, or 2019, 2019. And um, her husband was later charged with her murder. Okay. And then he committed suicide. It's kind of interesting the way the story is framed with her best friend recalling so much of it. Yes, um, Audrey, her best friend, her fictional best friend in the, in the story, uh, her best friend has still remained uh, a massive advocate and I think is the spokesperson for the family. Mm. Um, so yes, her, fa her friendship was a very uh, important part of the story with Audrey. And now Warren Christie plays uh, the husband, Fotis. When I found out he was playing this part, I was immediately in, I think he has such integrity as an actor and he really shows his range um, because so much of the first half of this movie is a love story. You know, they really fell in love. They fell in love enough to have five children. You know, it wasn't dysfunctional until later. Um, and Warren brings that beautiful uh, mixture of charm and sex appeal because he's quite handsome. Right. And um, and yet then has to go to these very dark places, which he handles, I think, just impeccably. It's really it's a tragic, terrifying story, um, because, again, it's that thing where this is someone you love. For sure. Yes. And I, I again, I think that's how all of these that that dynamic of loving someone who you think you can change or loving someone who wears who's wearing a mask, you know, but um, the 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 fatal tragedy in this is that she even doing all of those things protecting herself and her children she still was murdered right there's so much that you were able to use as research yes there was a, there was a lot i mean we were able to see like police reports and things like that and yet and yet this is a fictional account mm. um you know it's not authorized by the family but but there was a very definite intention by everyone involved to really honor Jennifer. And, um, you know, I think there are some elements. I know Michelle Traconis is on trial or awaiting trial right now. So, so there are some undetermined elements. But our goal, certainly mine personally, was to really give voice to this woman's story in a tender, respectful, hopefully honoring way. Well, listen, you're fantastic in the movie. It's so good. So congratulations to you. Uh, don't forget, everybody, Gone Mom on Lifetime, June 5th.